Hello everybody, Mr. Adrophy here, and uh, I've got a bunch of new viewers, and a bunch of people, uh, a few new subscribers, and I would like to say hello and welcome. And this is the other part of my channel. Um, this is my fish tank, and I will be showing you what I just did. I just finished installing a new filter. New filter, C4. My whale, Fluval, Penguin. I got so lucky. This literally doesn't have an inch to spare, which will be fine for a while because I have to move the tank out, which isn't cool. I, I don't like doing that. I see one problem. I've got this right here, which is going to get wet. So I think I'm going to have to um, take some duct tape and just cover that and make sure that it uh, doesn't get wet. Other than that, this is ready to go. I've got it primed. I've got it full of water. I think I got everything. I've rinsed everything off. I've got the bio wheel not running right now. We're going to get this going. Okay, I will show you what I'm going to do here. This is the basket you put your filter media in. Um, usually filter carbon, um, ammonia absorber, phosphate absorber, you know, any, any sort of chemical filtration you want. But I'll show you what I'm going to put in there. My old filter. Dirty one. Yuck, right? But there's all sorts of good bacteria on there. And that should populate everything with the good bacteria. I'm going to play around make sure it doesn't impede the flow at all. Um, I may cut it in half. But, yeah, maybe this will, uh, if it doesn't impede the flow, if it doesn't slow it down, it should help all of the, everything get cycled in a new filter. Okay. Final step, I know I've got this huge hole right here, this is temporary, because I think I'm going to get a glass canopy and a new, um, a new light. So this is just going to be here for a couple days. Um, I'm hoping fish don't jump out. I might set a little towel or something right here just so they can't. Just give them something to bounce off of. But this is uh, rather quiet. I mean, I'm a little impressed at uh, how quiet this is. Once it's running, once the water is at the correct level, it does get a really serious um, waterfall effect going when it gets a little bit down. Um, I may also do some aquascaping. But I don't know. I've got the sponge filter, the heater, and that all grouped together, which kind of clears up that side. I don't know. I gotta figure out what looks better, get the girlfriend's uh, opinion. So, what do you guys think? Yeah? I've heard very good things about this filter. And this filter is rated for a 70 gallon tank, which is twice what mine is. So this should make the water super, super clean.